we saw this uh, first man, which look, yeah, I love these stories like that. Is that is space and are astronauts something that you've always been interested in? No. Not at all, really. I mean, no space I, camp I never or dreamed anything? that big. Uh, really? Yeah, but after, you know, after doing this, it's, it's a bit like the whole process of researching this movie and getting to go to NASA and learning about the story was really... What do you do when you go to NASA and research? What do they tell you? Well, it's funny because it's, it's, they're wonderful people. It's a fascinating place, and it's one mind-bending thing after another. But I guess like anything, you know, if you do it long enough, it becomes normal to you. So they have a kind of a casualness when they're explaining this stuff to you. But I, I remember this one, uh, when I was getting the, a tour, the guy was giving a tour of the, the James Webb telescope, and he was like, very casually saying, you know, uh, well, look, it's all, all the, you know, the mirrors on this telescope will be able to, uh, you know, uh, decipher the atmospheres on distant planets, and uh, we should be able to see the uh, edge of the universe, and, you know, uh, I guess, uh, see the beginning and end of time. <laughs> <laughs> and then with equal enthusiasm, and over here is the vending machine. <laughs> There's only one more Snickers, so it while you can. Wow, wow. Yeah, I guess that is the way it goes, just about every place you go. Now, did you have to do physical training for this, or is it all movie magic? Um, I mean, do you have to... A lot of movie magic. Yeah. We did some physical training. We, you know, like, at NASA, there were lots of, you know, like, they put us through the paces in certain ways. And then in the film itself, there's a lot of, you know, like, for instance, they have a, uh, they built this multi-axis trainer, which is something that NASA designed just to sort of help the astronauts prepare for the worst case scenarios in space. Oh, really? But it's this thing that kind of sends you like, you know, ass over tea kettle for like, you know, like they would only do it for maybe 20 minutes at a time or something. But in the movie, because we had to get a lot of shots, minutes. I was in it for like six to eight hours. For real? Go with it going? Yeah, so I started to, to sort of smell a rat up here. You know. What do you mean? Well, like that I was, I, something was wrong. Like I was, I was that and getting banged around in the capsules and hitting my head that uh, something might be wrong. What was wrong? <laughs> well, I knew something was wrong when I called, uh, I went home one night and I called Ava and I was, uh, I was just hell-bent on this idea that there were people in donut stores all around the world, you know, trying to charm their way into getting free donuts. <laughs> and what did, what did Ava say to that? Well, she was, she was so patient and listening, and you know, and then she was saying, well, you know, I, I think you might have, you know, drain damage. <laughs> and I was like, no, no, there's there's donut charmers everywhere, and, and it's and it's a problem, and, and and no one's doing anything about it. This really happened. Yeah, and she was like, I've been saying you have drain damage as a joke, but I think you might have brain damage. <laughs> you know, you should go to the hospital. Did you go to the hospital? Yes. You did. Yeah. And what they say? Uh, that I had minor concussion. <laughs> but it was just, uh, wow. you know, they had to pull this, like, this poor couple out of dinner to come meet me there. And he was like a, like a prominent brain surgeon. And I think they were at a very fancy dinner and they just were like immaculately dressed and starving and watching <laughs> get a CAT scan. Did really, you at least send them some donuts yeah, afterwards? Yeah, and I felt bad because it was like, I wish it was more exciting for them. Yeah, like, well. A, a minor concussion. I bet it was a good story for them anyway. If you liked that video, click subscribe and we'll be together until one of us dies.